Now, let's answer question from random post at ito ay post ni Sir John Michael Torricampo dito sa Civil Service Exam 2022 Community. Let's solve this problem. 2020 minus 18 divided by negative of 3 squared. In this problem, we have subtraction, division, and Inside the parentheses, I exponent. We can only answer this correctly if we will follow order of operations. Step number one, parentheses. We have parentheses, but what is inside the parentheses? Exponent. Regarding exponent. Do not forget law of exponents. Later in this video, we are going to read our references regarding law of exponents. And we will also double check our answer using scientific calculators. Under law of exponent, this exponent only applies to 3 and not on the negative sign. So this will be negative 3 and then your exponent. This is 3 times 3. Just copy the negative sign. So your answer is negative 9. This is not equal to negative 3 squared because this means negative 3 times negative 3, which is equal to positive 9. We read this as negative of 3 squared, and that is equal to negative 9. So, dito sa, neg sa exponent natin, this is negative 9. Next, we will just copy the rest of the equation. So, we have division. Under order of operations, after exponent, we have multiplication, multiplication, or division. Ito yung step number three sa order of operations. Pero dito, yung operation natin dito ay division lang ang nandyan. So, unahin natin yan. So, we have negative 18 divided by negative 9 and that is positive 2. So, ang natitira na lang 2020 plus 2 and this is 2022. Yan na yung tamang sagot. Now, to double check. Now, let's go to the exponent first. Negative 3 squared. You see, scientific calculator, this is equal to negative 9. Now, if the parenthesis is like that, that means negative 3 times negative 3. That's why this is positive 9. Now, doon tayo sa mismong 2020 minus 18 divided by negative 3 and the answer here is 2022 or 2022. Now another scientific calculator. Let's go to the exponent first. Yung nasa loob ng parenthesis. So we have negative of 3 squared and this is equal to negative 9. Now, what if negative 3 squared, and this is positive 9, 2020 20 minus 18 divided by negative 3, and the answer here is 2022 or 2022. Therefore, our answer here is correct. Now, before we will proceed to our references, 
para sa mga bago pa sa channel ko, ito yung FB natin. Ito namang Philippine Civil Service Review for All. Pwede kayong pumunta dyan para maka-download ng mga libreng printable na reviewers dito sa files ng grupong ito. O iba pa mga FB groups na lagi nating tinatambayan. At ito naman yung FB pages na posibleng makatulong sa inyo. Now doon na tayo sa ating references. From grade 7 textbook, major mistake. Students often think that expressions such as negative 6 squared and negative of 6 squared are the same. They are not always the same. Let's read this again. They are not always the same. Kasi minsan, sometimes, they are the same kapag yung exponent ay odd numbers. Kapag yung exponent ay odd, example, negative 3, then the exponent is 3, negative 3, tapos yung exponent na 3. This means 3 times 3 times 3. This is 27. Copy the negative sign. Now this one, negative 3 times negative 3 times negative 3. Negative times negative, positive. Positive times negative, negative 27. They are not always the same kasi Kapag this is even, the exponent is even. So, for example, this is 2. So, we only have 3 times 3, and this is 9. Copy the negative sign. So, this is negative 9. While here, negative 3 times negative 3, Positive, so this is positive 9. So according to this textbook, negative 6 squared, the exponent applies to negative 6. While negative of 6 squared, the exponent applies only to 6. Therefore, negative of Six squared is not equal to negative six squared. So anyway, hanggang dito na lang muna, hindi na natin yan basahin lahat since marami na tayong na-upload regarding law of exponents. So kung gusto niyong tingnan yung iba pa mga examples about law of exponent, pwede niyong isulat yung Leonalin, law of exponent. Or pwedeng Leonalin exponent, yun lang. Search nyo para ma 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 sort out lahat ng mga dati na nating na-upload regarding sa exponents. Thank you for watching and all I hope na gets nyo na kung bakit ang tamang sagot dito ay 2022.